tiny city, a blue-collar town in the heartland of America. But this great city faces a sinister threat. Supervillain crime is at an all-time high thanks to the villains like the evil Dmitri Popov, Nikolai Lenin, and the ever-elusive red speedster known as The Dart. Meanwhile, our heroes are overworked and outnumbered, spending their days at civilian jobs just to afford life as a hero. But on June 8, 1946, all that changes when you vote yes for the League of Heroes. The world's first superhero labor union is here, led by the fastest trigger in all the states, Jeffrey Warner, the Grey Raven. His kid sidekick, Sparrow, a master of eight different martial arts. And let's not forget about the amazing Blue Blaze. There's nothing he can't do with that energy ring, kids. But just imagine what we could do full time. That's right, Blaze. If the city gives the League of Heroes a contract to fight supervillains and the evil they rain down, we support ourselves by doing what we do best. Helping more of you fine people. And being better heroes. So what do you think about the League, Sparrow? Well, gosh, I think it's great. I want to be a hero forever. Good evening. My guest tonight is Jeffrey Warner, the once legendary hero Grey Raven, now head spokesman for the League of Heroes. Within months, the League plans to go nationwide, expanding its sphere of influence throughout the country. So, Jeffrey, I guess the question becomes... Why go national? Exactly. Well, we've uh, worked hard for a long time to make Chicago a safe place. And the numbers are astounding. A 91% decrease in city crime since your start. I like to think that we're a proven factor now. The people of Chicago are safer than they've ever been, and people across the country should be afforded the same peace of mind. But what about the recent return of the Dart, the infamous red speed villain who's plagued the League for years? Many people believe his return is fueled by the idea of the League expanding nationally in protest to your success. Yes, I'm very aware of those rumors. And you're not worried that he's going to go on a killing spree? No. No, not really. We've always been able to stop the dart in the past. Sadly, we all remember your former sidekick, Sparrow, who was wounded. Do you and Sparrow get to talk anymore since he's Obviously, the dart's return is a shock to us all, but uh, in the past, we've always succeeded in stopping the dart's plan. The League is stronger than it's ever been, and I'm supremely confident that we'll be able to thwart the dart before his plan causes any great threat to the city. It is the 10th murder in the past two weeks. The sonic booms at the dart terrorizes the city at the speed of sound. Once again, officials are baffled as the dart continues on his citywide killing spree. Dart's signature red light streak. With the murder count quickly rising, Hundreds of eyewitnesses have reported seeing red light streaks throughout the city. Though the infamous red speed villain hasn't been seen in nearly a decade, many residents blame his return on the League's plan to expand nationally. In a statement issued earlier today, the League has assured the city they are handling the situation and are combining their patrols with local police in the areas surrounding the killings. For the city's sake, hopefully Jeffrey Warner can make good on his promise to stop the dark. Speedster. Big deal. Nobody's seen him in years. The guy's a joke. Looks like we got another dead supervillain. Oh, which one? The Red Renegade. You two heroes really want to be helpful. I hear there's a cat stuck up in a tree on Pulaski. Son of a bitch won't come down. Smoke break. Back off.
League goes national, I am out of this shithole. Go someplace where there's some real action. This is real. Holy shit. League business, what the hell are you doing? Your job. Well, isn't that special? Thinks he could just walk in here like he's better than us or something. I wonder how much better you're gonna be when I take out your other eye, you vigilante piece of shit. <laughs> I heard you were in town. Why well, the dart hunting villains? Red Renegade last night, nine others before that. Why is he only targeting supervillains? We're not sure. Why are you back here? I want the dart, Jeffrey. You think that's wise? Who's left of the old villains? Dmitry Popov and Nikolai Lenin. They're the leaders. You should have found them first. As good as it is to see you here, kid, I don't appreciate you telling me how to do my job. Stay out of it. The darts hunting villains. Red Renegade wouldn't be out in the open in some alley unless it was important. That means nothing. It's a lead, kid. The dart almost killed you. You're not a part of this league anymore. I'm warning you. Stay out of it. All that matters is that we stop them. Or have you completely forgotten how it's like to be a hero? Damn it.
sends a husband to kill me, huh? Nikolai Lenin. It's been a long time. I just want information. On the dart. How did you find me? You must really be desperate to leave a message. Uncoded. Is that where Popoff is? Why is the dart hunting the old villains? It's not the dart. How do you know? <laughs> <laughs> because your partner killed the dart. Jeffrey's not a killer. Your kid's sidekick get blown up? That changes a guy. I was there when he Strangle the dart. Why would you help him? <laughs> what is the saying in your country? The money is good, no? Oh. <laughs> he does not tell you, huh? The league pays us villains. Now they go national, legit. He's just dying up loose ends. People have seen the dart. If we couldn't fake that. <laughs> they say the Grey Raven was the fastest trigger in all the states. Maybe he's faster than you thought. Huh? Well, well. Look who's breaking and entering. God damn it! No! Sorry. I'll try to be faster at the force field next time. Jeffrey, have you keeping tabs on me? You shouldn't be involved in this one, kid. Though it would be good to see you around more. The League sure misses you. The League's not what it used to be. What it was supposed to be. Well, nothing ever is. Can't deal with the police. Not yet. Something I have to do. Well, let me talk to them. See if they might. You murdered the dart. Now you're posing as him to kill the villains you've been paying. Before they can talk.
What have you done, Jeffrey? This doesn't concern you. You quit. Remember? We cleaned out the city too fast. And it should be done. It's not that simple. Not all of us can just give up on this league, kid. It's all we know. What are you supposed to do when the city you saved doesn't need you anymore? You'd be surprised at what you'll do to keep going. Now we have a chance. This league goes national, we can help people again. We can be real heroes again, Boyle. No. This isn't about helping people. Not for you. You just can't let go of the life, the fame. And now they're too old to wear that suit. Running this league's the only glory you have. <laughs> and there's no glory in you coming back for the dark. Well, you can't stop this. Not anymore. There's still Popoff. Except no one's protecting him while you're standing here with me. If I could move fast enough to be the dark, do you really think you wouldn't know about it by now? He could do anything with that ring. He would change color. Why would he kill for you? Listen, kid. You came back for the dart. There's no reason for you to be involved in this. So I'm telling you, it's all right to walk away this time. No one else dies for you. If Popov talks, then what happens to all the people who need us? Who's going to be there? Not everyone's in this for the wrong reasons, Jeffrey. Dmitry Popov, I'm gonna keep you alive, but you're gonna talk. You think you can do that? Mm. Good. Now let's find your new hiding spot. Pop off. You've been following me since I got back in town. Please. Just let me finish this. Not like this. Is that what you've turned into? Jeffrey's lapdog? What happened to you? You used to be a hero. I haven't been a hero in a long time. Do you really think I'd lead you right to him? Where is he?
doesn't matter. Out of the city. Now this is between you and me. Please. We both know you can't stop me. Doesn't mean I'm not gonna try. Fine, Pawbolt, I know too much. You're gonna have to kill me too. You think you're gonna run? of Chicago were stunned today to learn of new allegations that charged the League of Heroes with bankrolling supervillains. Testimony given by Dmitry Popov, a villain allegedly on the League's payroll, points to possible involvement by key members of the League, including League Chief Jeffrey Warner, formerly the Grey Raven. This information, if proven true, comes as a serious blow to the League's plan to expand nationally and could even call into question the League's very existence. <laughs> 